What's up guys, Luke Albans here, Dave and Tyler, back again for a Rebel Clash box opening. Forgot what we were opening <laughs> for a second. Uh, Rebel Clash box opening. Um, check out our previous video. Dave just opened a Darkness Ablaze booster box opening. Well, some good stuff. Pretty cool hits. Yeah, pretty yeah. cool hits. Not disappointed. Yeah, definitely not. So you definitely have to check that video out. Um, we just hit 3,000 followers on our Instagram. Make sure you guys check it. Uh, check out our Instagram if you're not following us already. We have a giveaway coming soon that will be announced probably in the next couple days yep. um, from when this video is recorded. Um, and then uh, main rule, and most of you guys probably aren't following us or sub to us on YouTube. Make sure you sub to us on YouTube or you cannot win um, the giveaway. Yeah, that's what's gonna get. That's what's gonna get you the most entries. So. Yeah. Um, there's going to be a few different ways to, to enter. We're going to run it through Gleam. We'll have a webpage for it. It'll go over all the different ways that you can enter. It's super easy. Um, so just stay tuned to that. Check, uh, Keep up to date with our Instagram. Wait for us to post that. It should be coming within the next day or so. So, so I'm going to take these out. You're going to do a little shuffle? You're just going to... I'm going to just do a little shuffling. Nothing too crazy. Just, yeah. just a... A little. So many cards that you can pull out of this yeah. pack. Yeah, wow. I said it in one of our previous videos. I think Rebel Clash is a little slept on compared yeah. to some of the other sets that are out there right now. Lots of secret rares. This is what you can get Dragapult out of, the secret yeah. rare. And I know you so, want that card. I do want that it's card. It's like your, your favorite freaking Pokemon ever. So it's up there. Let's see if I can keep up with Dave. I want to beat Dave's time. You know, our videos were getting a little better. Most of them are uh, over an hour long. Yeah, Dave um, just recorded one and it was like 30 minutes long. Yeah. So I want to see if I can beat that so far. We're not off to a good start because I can't get this pack open. <laughs> uh, but, all right, we broke into it. Cold hands. Yeah, gotta, gotta get used up. to it. You know, I haven't opened packs in a little bit. So, so the most expensive Co card, card that you can pull from Rebel Clash is Sonya, the secret rare. It's about $50. Okay, all right, cool. Um, but there are so many different secret rares that you can pull from this pack that are over ten dollars um it's a really Surfetched, cool surfetched hollow surfet um yeah i mean i love full art trainers um i think whether they're secret rare or they're just regular full arts the trainer cards are my favorite new cards that they've come out with in the recent like years i feel like the full art trainers they're just they look so good um even if they're a bad trainer card they're just, I just like to collect them. I just bump the camera. Awesome. Yeah, great. I was doing that a lot last video. So. We're off to a great start already. This is going to be great. Uh, Zacian reverse. Zacian. Nothing crazy. Yeah, I'm not really going to stop and, you know, stay on like the, the non hollows or the hollows hits um, too long. Um, kind of just want to breeze through this, make sure this video is not going to run over too, too long. Um, we're getting very close to a thousand subs on YouTube. We're almost yeah. at almost at eight hundred. Very close. Um, so let's get to a thousand. That'll really really help us out. Something good. Dreepy. That's the first evolution of Dragapult. Oh. Into a Toxtricity V. And our first hit. Nice. Not too bad. Yeah, not bad. Cool you run card. that card in my electric deck. Pretty good. And the VMAX is, is decent as well. These packs, like, I cannot get my fingers in there to open these. <laughs> I'm also, like, trying to look through the camera to see the pack. Yeah, that was That's always not, my problem. I cannot get this open. We're not off to a good start here. I'm trying to breeze through this. There is a secret rare version of Tox Okay. Uh, of the V Max. Okay. The V, that is not the full art. That's about a dollar fifty for that card. Okay. Not too bad. Not bad for being a uh, you know, on the bottom of the uh, Toxtricities. Nothing good so far. We got one V hit. Not too bad. I'm not complaining. I think I already have that card because th there is a Toxtricity like V collection box that you oh, can okay. get. And uh, it, I think it's the same exact artwork. It just has promo in the bottom oh, okay. corner. Yeah. Um, so I think I already have that card. So not it doesn't bother me that I got it again. I just I want to see some other stuff. Well, we're still early in the pack opening. Funnel B. Let's get some good hits. 
breeze through these packs. Okay. Yeah, so um, I mentioned it in the last video. We do have a Mercari store uh, that is live um, until our website is fully up to date and ready to go. Um, so check out our Mercari store. It is linked in our link tree on our Instagram. Um, I will be posting a Elder Gross V, if I can get the camera to focus. Nice. Nice, full art. I got a price check on that real quick then. Um, yeah, so check out our uh, Mercari store. I know a bunch of you guys asked us about buying some of the dollar store packs. I will have some of those posted on our Mercari store. You can pick some of those up. And as we find more at our local dollar, uh, dollar stores, I will be posting those up there. Uh, what we have right now is some Unbroken Bond three packs, uh, dollar store cards. And then I also have some Pikachu, uh, Detective Pikachu Charizard GX case files that will be up on there. Oh, another hit. I see into behind there. Dragapult V. So we got the evolution straight into Dragapult. Nice. Nice. Dude. Beautiful, beautiful looking card. By the way, just to back up a second, Eldegoss, that is an $8 card. An $8 card. So a pretty good pull. Yeah. How much um, is that Dragapult? Yeah, that's what I'm going to look up next. Awesome card. Yeah. I, I mean, I don't even care about the. Uh, I know they're not worth value. a ton, but. Um, they just look cool. I just love the Pokemon. Yeah. Though. I think I might have covered up a letter on that code card. Nope. Well, I know I got nothing from this. Yeah, I'm really bad at like hiding the back card, but uh. Yeah, Dragapult V, the normal, just two dollar card, but. Cool Pokemon. Ooh, that one opened like butter. butter. Straight into that one. Code card for you. I might have also covered up a letter on that, but you guys will figure it out. <laughs> Hey, hey! A lot of hits. Yeah. Starting off pretty strong. Nine Tails V. I think I also have that card already. <laughs> I am fairly positive you do. Yeah. All right. Off to a pretty good start. Four, five hits? Is that four? I think it's five. Yeah, I mean, whatever it is, we're off to a very good start with this box opening so far. Uh, ooh, a, or a hollow fable. Nine tails V, another two dollar and forty cent card. Hey, that's not bad. I'm so used to opening the dollar store packs. These packs feel so heavy compared to the dollar yeah. store packs. Yeah. Yeah, you might be right. People really do sleep on these. There's just so many V cards and V maxes and secret maxes or secret maxes, secret rares. <laughs> yeah. That um, there's just so many hits in this. Yep. In this pack. Litwick. Yeah, I mean, I was debating whether keeping this box sealed or uh, opening it. Um, I just like keeping stuff sealed just so that, you know, I know it's in pristine condition and all that stuff. But then opening it too, like I was just sitting here debating. Yeah, and you know what? I want to open it. I want to see what's in there. Um, the curiosity got the best of me on this box. So, and so far I'm not disappointed at all. Is this a, oh yeah. I guess yeah, you probably is. just can't yeah, see it. Yeah, that doesn't even look like it's a reverse. Those dark cards, yeah. man. Mandibugs. Something good. Hey, I mean, I'm not complaining about what we got so far. Yeah, let me count how many hits you've had so far. That's no, four. Oh! Hits. Wow, nice! <laughs> secret rare tool scraper. First secret rare. Nice. Reverse tool scraper, cycle. secret rare, an $8 card. Actually, that's worth less than, um, what did you pull? The Eldegoss full art. Hey, I don't care. It but looks awesome. Our first secret rare. Centering looks a little off top to bottom on the front. And a little off left to right on the back. So, yeah. 
Uh, but other than that, super yeah. cool cards. Yeah, though. love the gold secret. Yeah, rares. gold secret is they look so good. We were just talking about that in the last video. I wish they did more of the gold secret. I'm, I I like the rainbow secret rares. They they're they're cool. The outline on that wrench too is so cool. Yeah, I don't know something about the gold ones. They just look so cool. Very cool looking cards. Reverse full heal. No hit. We've had more hits than no hits, I think. Yeah, I mean, our pile's looking pretty good there. Now, that is also, I did shuffle it up. So, we watch. Shuffle. We might get to the end here, and there might be nothing for the rest of the box. We're going to hit a point, maybe. Maybe not, because there is just so many good cards to pull in Rebel Clash. Most of the packs might just be a hit. Yeah, I mean, a lot of cards here. Let's see what we got. A lot of possibilities. Hollow Luxray, Reverse Hollow Chadot. Chadot. Oh boy. The Luxray Hollow looks pretty good. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like those Hollows like just don't hold any value at all. Really? It's interesting how the lines going up and down in the, in the hollow. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys saw Leon Hart's uh, latest video. He did get sent some of the hit cards, the main chase cards out of Shining Fates. They sent him some just so he could kind of show what uh, what's going to be pulled from that. And there is some beautiful looking cards in Shining Fates. Just, I mean, the shiny Charizard alone, but just like the the new amazing rare cards that they have in that set. Um, yeah, there's some beautiful looking cards in that in that set. I am super excited about Shining Fates. Yeah, I'm really, I'm really excited for it as well. I think um, our opening for Shining Fates will probably definitely blow our Vivid Voltage opening away. I hope so. I hope so. I, I like that. The thing about Shining Fates is there's no booster box. So right, yeah, what do you so... get? What do you get? You get. Uh, the elite trainer box you get some of the blister packs yeah you get some of the pin collection um boxes and like the pool rates are a little bit higher yeah. to compensate for that but yeah. yeah you just get less packs to work with a benzor bronzor uh, okay just mispronouncing pokemon over here Br bronzor yeah, definitely more difficult to get those packs that don't ship in the booster box yeah, and the price on Shining Fates right now is outrageous. Like, oh yeah, the demand's gonna be insane. The, the I mean. closer we get to the release, it releases in like two weeks. The the closer we get to the release date, I think the more the more the price is going up <laughs> because the people are like, I need to get this. I need. We to get haven't. This. They haven't even started selling it. I know. Oh, Grim Snarl Hollow. You're on a little dry spell now. Yeah, that's just the way she goes. Yep. Way, way she goes. Let's see. Can we get anything good? Nope. More lax. Let's go to the other side real quick. Start Someone grabbing something from the other side. So we're looking for that Sonya Secret Rare Pool yep. Art Trainer. That's what we're chasing in this box. No Charizard, unfortunately, in this one. No Rainbow Pikachu. Um, pool Art Trainer. That's your most expensive. I want you to pull the Dragapult Secret Rare. Yeah, I mean, that would be very cool. Definitely uh, something that I do want to pull. You don't have one of those, right? I don't believe so. Yeah. I don't think I have that. I do have one. Um... It's one that I purchased off of eBay. It's not in the best condition, but yeah, I do have one. Let's see. We still got a good amount of packs left. It'll oh yeah, still definitely be something good. I don't even think you're halfway through. Hiding in there. Is that a Barascuda. My pile of bulk is getting pretty big here. Yeah, that's the struggle, opening all these packs. What do we do with all these commons? 
Yeah, I don't know. Um, I talked about it a little bit in the previous video. Um, people saying, people recommending that you can sell them to certain sites and stuff. I don't know. I'd, I'd If I was going to get rid of them, I'd rather just give them away to kids that would actually, like, enjoy them. Um, yeah, maybe we even turn that into, like, an ongoing giveaway later on. Yeah. We just do, like, little... Uh packs of commons and maybe some reverse hollows that we throw in there and maybe even some of the other bigger cards and yeah. we just like continuously give those away over time yeah i know like a lot of people do like mystery packs and stuff i'm not in on that mystery pack game it's like uh, don't buy mystery packs there is no ebay seller no facebook marketplace seller out there that is actually going to give you anything worth what you're paying for the pack right um ours if we did do mystery packs would be completely free we would yeah. just be it would just be something that we would be giving away to you guys um yeah and picking someone who gets like a bunch of mystery packs uh and we oh, oh. dragapult v max the full art that's awesome 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 not the secret rare but still an not awesome looking card rare, but still is that the v max you said yep let's look at the centering on this about an eight dollar card yeah um, it'd be a little bit top to bottom on the back. Other than that, beautiful looking card. Let me take a look at that sucker. Get in his sleeve. Yeah. Really good looking card. We are smidge off. I would say we're probably halfway, maybe a little bit more than halfway done with this box already. Flying through this box. Nothing good. Bump the camera again. I love doing that. I love bumping now. <laughs> okay, this pack just got demolished. <laughs> it's just ripping to shreds. No hit. Little bit. I mean, I don't want to say we're on dry street because we just got that Dragapult V Max, but we started off very strong. Yeah, we got spoiled in the beginning. Yep. That's what happened to you on the Vivid Voltage, too. Yep. Actually, now that I think yeah, about it. Yeah, third pack in, pulled that Pikachu. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty nutty. A Lampant into a Chandelure, the evolutionary chain there. Nice. All right, we're getting Hollow down. Hit. Yeah, getting down to not a lot of packs left. Come on, there is no. definitely a Sonya in here. I can feel it. I can feel it. I don't know what the seed rate is for a Sonya. I don't know how many, like what the pull rate is. Um, I don't really care to look it up. If I get it, I get it. If I don't, I don't, so. Magikarp. Freaking magic card. Start a new pile of bulk here. Yeah, your your first one's about to topple over there. Yeah, getting pretty tall. Getting close. Yep, seven packs. It looks like we got left. Seven chances is what I hear. <laughs> Pokeball reverse. Yep, we got about this. Yep, seven packs. So this one and and six more, and you got to feel out the heaviest one. Set it aside. All right, I'll do that after this pack. Of your favorite artwork. I don't even know what my favorite artwork would be in this set. I see Toxtricity and Cinderace there. Um, I don't know. I don't know what my favorite pack artwork out of this set would be. Palpitoad. All right, so let's let's see it out. So we got Inteleon, Toxtricity, Cinderace, Rillaboom, and another Toxtricity. So this one's definitely heavier out of those. This one's still heavier. I think this one, this Toxtricity pack. Beating everyone out. It could also be a mental thing. Well, 
All right, down to our last six packs. We flew through this box opening. Yeah, no, this is flying through it. What do we got? Maybe I should stay in frame here. I see something. I see something. <laughs> something and... good. A double B. <laughs> Stop. I opened so many double V champions patch collectors boxes. This is the same artwork. It just doesn't say promo. Yeah. I don't need it. I don't even care. Yeah. I have so many of them. Feels bad a little bit. <laughs> it's a hit, though. It is a hit. But it took one of the good hits. But, yeah, exactly. Yeah, how much is that card even worth? Uh, if I had a dollar. Guess, less than a dollar. Actually, yeah, dollar seventy one. It's a little higher than I thought. Making the money back. Slowly but surely. Capture our speed energy into a glaring wheezing hollow. Thinking of that capture energy that you got out of the last one. Yeah, that's secret rare. It's on my mind. That was a good hit. We not get a seat. We didn't get a single secret out of this box so far, did we? Oh no, we did. We got the tool One. scraper. Yeah, you also. No, I can't. Be, I can't complain. Yeah. I can't complain. I I think it was one of the cheaper um, secret rares. It though. wasn't bad. It was an eight dollar card, and you pulled a couple other eight dollar cards as well. So it's not all bad. Yeah, not 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 too bad. Let's see. Nope. Come on. We got two packs and that toxicity on the bottom oh is the heavy one. It's the heavy one. Last pack magic. It just, it just got an extra thick code card in the back. Yeah, you think so? Yep. Maybe something, somebody will get something good on the, the code online game. Yeah. yeah. Hey, boss's Ooh. order. I think this is actually one of the more expensive cards out yeah. of this. Now I know that does come in a secret rare. Yep. However, the full art is a $25 card. $25. One, two, three, four, five. Sixth, sixth most expensive card in this pack. So. Centering is definitely off on the front, left to right. Not bad. Honestly, not too bad on the back. Maybe a tiny, tiny bit top to bottom. Really cool but, uh, trainer. Yeah, no. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I love full art trainers. I'm happy that I got Boss's Order. I know it's one of the more desirable full art trainers because it actually has playability to it. Um, so definitely a nice card to add to my collection. Yeah, good hit. I'm glad we got something yeah. like, really good so far. Yeah, I mean, you got your, your tool scraper and that now as well. Yep. Yep. Oh, some good hits. My bulk pile is falling. Tower is collapsing. Last. You know, feeling this pack now. Pack magic. You got to give it a little tap, oh, yeah. dude. Feeling this pack now, it feels very light. <laughs> I think someone switched it out. <laughs> that boss's older one. Yeah, baited. That boss's older one. That was the. That was actually the one I meant. Yeah, that was that was a good hit. Happy to pull that. Or happy to see you pull that. Yeah. But uh, all right, last pack. Let's go. It's nothing. <laughs> hey, a boss's That's a boss's order. Boss's order, but a normal oh, hollow. Normal hollow. That's funny. Does that even have any value? Um, that has a four dollar value. Yeah. So believe it or not. Playable, playable card. That's why it has value to it. That's the one that you can throw in your deck. And yeah. That's the one that you can yeah. store away. Yeah, exactly. So let's do a quick recap, real quick. Um, we have the boss's order, the double V, the Dragapult V Max. That's my favorite of your the hits. Luxray Hollow. Tool Scraper, Secret Rare, Ninetales V, Dragapult V, Eldegross V, and our first pull, a Toxtricity V. So definitely our two big kind of hitters here, I believe, are going to be these two, um, yeah. the Tool Scraper and the Boss's Order. Definitely two nice cards. I'm very happy to add those to my collection. Uh, I couldn't have asked for better cards besides Sonya, but honestly, the Boss's Order beautiful looking card um here's some code cards while i am finishing up um yes yeah, so make sure you guys are following us on instagram 
Yep. Make sure you guys are subbed to the YouTube channel. Yep. Because you cannot win this upcoming giveaway if you are not subbed to the YouTube channel. It's our 3,000 follower Instagram fo uh, giveaway. We will have a Gleam link in the description of these videos of this one and the previous video that Dave opened uh, uh, Darkness Ablaze in yep. um, to that Gleam giveaway. So make sure you guys uh, do everything on that Gleam giveaway link. You can get multiple entries to the giveaway. It'll probably run for about a week or two once it's announced. Um, it will be for a good prize. We are gonna oh, yeah. have a pretty good prize to give away. So stay tuned for yeah. that. Make sure you're following us on Instagram. That'll be uh, displayed on there. Um, yeah, the last giveaway, we did a Champions Path Elite Trainer Box. We definitely yeah. wanna to top that. We wanna make yeah. this a lot better. So we had a lot of success with that one. Um, yeah, we had thank a lot you guys. of fun with it. So yeah, thank you guys for entering that. It went uh, a lot better than I thought. A lot more people entered it than yeah. uh, I thought. Uh, make sure you check out our Macari store. Yep. If you guys want to pick up some dollar store packs or some Detective Pikachu case files, the Charizard GX one. Um, and just uh, check out our website. Yeah, lukegoblins.org. Stay tuned for that. Uh, we will make an Instagram post uh, once that is officially live and ready to go. We're getting closer uh, every day. Yeah, yeah. It's slowly, slowly in the works. Yeah, the distributors are the, the stuff that's holding us back yeah. right now. But um, other than that, uh, make sure you guys follow us on Instagram. Stay tuned for the giveaway. Sub to our YouTube channel. Um, and I guess we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Yep. See ya.